Hello and welcome to a special edition of Is My Ardevoid Dead? Here we have a Ardevoid that was set in by a user who was having some problem with some uploads. Um, if you turn it on, nothing happens. That's not necessarily the worst of signs, but let's see if we can get, uh, sometimes you can get flashlight mode to work by holding the up button and then turning it on. Uh, that would make the OLED go white and turn on the LED, but in this case it's not working for us. So uh, another test is when you plug it in, um, you know, the red LED uh, comes on, that means it is charging. Um, again, turning it on doesn't do anything. Uh, so um, typically you see this happening when you try to flash it. Uh, of course, there's going to be um, no port available. That's the first sign you've got some problems. And uh, usually when you see it trying to upload, uh, you're going to have some problems there as well. So um, just for comparison, let's look at a fully functioning Artiboy and see what, uh, what that will do uh, as far as behavior-wise. So let's unplug that. And this is a fully functional Artiboy. So when it turns on, uh, we've got some hello, hello world going on. Um, and then when we plug in, you can hear the USB chime, and that's where we really want to look for. So in this circumstance, uh, let's go ahead and just see what usually happens when we upload it. So we've got port 3 selected. We're going to try and upload it. And the important thing is that you see these uh, yellow and green lights flash. Let's do that again because it was actually off camera. So that's indicating a, a correctly working Artiboy. Um, just to show you again what we would expect from flashlight mode to work, if it was working correctly, we hold down the up button and then turn it on. This is flashlight mode. It's a recovery mode that if otherwise your Artiboy seems bricked, um, you'll be able to upload code into it. So this is a working Artiboy. Let's go back to the other one that we're having some problems with. Okay, this is, a, this is the Artiboy that's given us some trouble. Um, the, the best thing you can do to determine if it's really bricked or not, um, we have one more step, and it's this little button here. It's the reset button. Uh, so the, the best way to test this is when you plug it in, and you'll need a uh, SIM ejector tool works really good. Uh, you can also use a paper clip or anything else that um, you can stick into this little button here. And go ahead and give this a listen. If I can push the button. Okay, see how we got a USB chime? And actually, if we're quick here, we can actually see that there is a port 9 available. So let's go ahead and select that. Oh, see it disconnected. So let's listen for that again. So we push the button. We've got a USB connected chime. And it'll go about 8 seconds, I think. And then it's disconnected. So that's the window in which you're going to be able to upload to the, the device. And so the best way that I've found to do this is just to go ahead and click upload and then wait for it to begin pulling the Artiboy as it is now and then press reset. It was able to find port 9, we get the good flashes on the LEDs down here and we're ready to go. We've recovered, successfully recovered an Artiboy. And so we've got one more here so let's go ahead and try to recover that one as well. Any number of circumstances can cause this to happen if you have a bad upload. If, uh, if you've got a bad USB cable that disconnects during a transfer. Um, but the reset button should, in almost all cases, be able to uh, fix it. So in this circumstance, see, uh, we try to turn it on, nothing happens. So we plug it in, turn it on, nothing happens. So what do we expect will happen, what do we hope will happen when we press this reset button? We should get a USB chime, so let's listen. Okay, that means it's going to be capable to, to fix this guy. So let's see what port that was when it comes up. So we'll go ahead and uh, press reset. And let's check what port we got. Whoops. Oh, see, it even read the thing. So we're still on port 9. Great. Okay, so let's just ha go ahead and hit, hit upload. It's looking for the port, hit reset, boom, there we go. We are fixing Artiboys, man. All right, so hopefully this little guide helps you out on recovering your Artiboys. If you're still having issues, 
trying to bring your Artaboy back to life, go ahead and reach out to us at artaboy.com slash contact, and we will do our best to uh, see what we can do to help you out. All right, thanks very much, everybody. Hang in there. You can do it.